Well, the employees of Zappos are sharing their secrets on how to electrify your work by putting service first. Now, the details are all inside this new book. Uh, it's called The Power of Wow. And here to, here to discuss it, I can't talk this morning, <laughs> is Kelly Smith from Zappos.com. Kelly, good morning to you. Good morning. All right, The Power of Wow. Let's talk about it. What, what is inside this book? There's so much good stuff inside <laughs> this book. Um, this is actually the first time that uh, Zappos has put out a book since Delivering Happiness, which our CEO Tony Shea wrote over 10 years ago. And so our customers have been asking for the past 10 years, we want to know more, we want to learn about your company, we want to hear just more that we have to share with the world. And what's cool is that um, because we are organized and give employees so much autonomy in the workplace, Tony thought, what better way to tell that story than to have our actual employees be part of that story instead of it being about him. So we have over 22 different authors who've shared their personal perspectives and it's all about service and how leaning on that power of wow that we deliver as a company, whether it's for our customers or internally, that it helps us stay resilient through all the changes that we go through over the 10 years. When you say on autonomy in the workplace, what mm -hmm. exactly does that mean? It means trust. Um, and I think that's what's been really cool to see is that we've kind of looked at the traditional managerial hierarchy and have kind of looked at ways that we can give everyone a voice in the company. And so instead of needing to kind of pitch your ideas to managers, we kind of lean on our employees to make those decisions on their own and to kind of lead the forces of the company and to pursue creative decisions. And I think that being said, going back to this book, a lot of that was set up that way as well. And it's a perfect example of that too. Zappos has definitely become very well known for its unique onboarding and recruiting process. Mm -hmm. um, so tell me a little bit about that and what it means to be a Zapponian. Is that what you're <laughs> Zapponian, <laughs> yeah. Um, so being a Zapponian is really cool. So I actually started in recruiting um, before I was on this team. And I think with onboarding, we prioritize, we have 10 core values in the company. And those are so important for us because when we are hiring, we are looking for candidates who kind of fit those 10 core values and are looking to be excited about coming to work for the company and to have the teams be excited as well. And so I think because of that, it makes it really unique to have um, these people who will easily become Zaponians <laughs> and embrace those values once they start. I love that. Well, one yeah. of your core values, create fun and a little weirdness, which I feel like is just a great <laughs> a motto fun for life as well. Do you feel like that sense of just kind of creating that fun and being, you know, ha being open to being a little weird sometimes, mm -hmm. do you think that makes you more efficient in the workplace? I think so because it helps you kind of be yourself and mm -hmm. so instead of having to be in a job where you feel like you have to fit in a cookie cutter mold or wear a mask and change who you are, I think that allows us to kind of be ourselves and it's okay if you're a little quirky, we actually enjoy that. Um, and I think because of that, that helps us be more efficient because you can be yourself and exactly you're not job. trying to pretend to be something that you're not. Exactly. I love that. Really quick, where do you get the book? So you can get this at any local bookstores or retailers. It's for sale on Amazon.com right now. And so go check it out. The power of wow the out now. Wow. I love it. All right, yes. Kelly, thank you so much for coming in. Really appreciate it. Thank you. Yes. All right. More news and weather coming up after the break.